ladies and gentlemen, comic book enthusiasts, and fans of epic superhero showdowns, welcome to a thrilling and speculative clash of titans. Today, we're diving deep into the imaginative realm of comics to explore a hypothetical battle that's been debated among fans for years, Homelander vs. Miles Morales and Miguel O'Hara. In one corner, we have Homelander, the superpowered leader of the Seven from the Boys universe. With incredible strength, heat vision, and in the other corner, we've got not one, but two Spider-Men from the Marvel Universe. First up is the agile and venom-blasting Miles Morales, the Spider-Man who's been captivating fans since his debut. But wait, we've got more. Enter Miguel O'Hara, also known as Spider-Man 2099, with his enhanced physical abilities and futuristic gadgets. It's a battle of power, strategy, and wit. Can Homelander's Ra might overcome the combined forces of two spider people? Or will Miles Morales and Miguel O'Hara's agility, ingenuity, and teamwork prove to be the ultimate trump card? Stick around as we analyze their strengths, weaknesses, and the potential scenarios in which this epic showdown might take place. Who do you think will emerge victorious in this fierce contest of superhuman ability? Let's dive right in and find out. But before we get started, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss an episode of our epic comic book battles. Now, without further ado, let the battle of Homelander vs. Miles Morales and Miguel O'Hara begin. Welcome to vs. The Ultimate Superhero Showdown. Miles Morales and Homelander are characters from different fictional universes. Miles Morales is a character from Marvel Comics, specifically associated with the Spider-Man mantle. At the same time, Homelander is a character from the comic book series The Boys published by Dynamite Entertainment. Miles Morales, the Spider-Man of his universe, possesses similar powers to the original Spider-Man, Peter Parker. He has enhanced strength, agility, and the ability to stick to walls. Additionally, Miles has the Venom Blast, an electric shock attack that can incapacitate his enemies. Homelander, on the other hand, is a character from The Boys, a dark and satirical take on superheroes. Homelander is a member of the Seven, a team of superpowered individuals with various abilities. He possesses superhuman strength, invulnerability, and the ability to fly. He can also emit powerful laser beams from his eyes. In terms of raw power, Homelander has a significant advantage. He possesses superhuman strength and invulnerability, making him a formidable opponent. However, it's worth noting that Miles Morales is known for his agility, intelligence, and his ability to think on his feet during battles. In a confrontation between the two, the outcome would likely depend on the circumstances, strategy, and creative choices made by the writers. It's difficult to determine a definitive winner without specific details about the scenario or the intentions of the comic book creators. Continue. If we were to explore a hypothetical confrontation between Miles Morales and Homelander, we could consider some additional factors. Miles Morales has the advantage of being a highly agile and acrobatic fighter. His spider sense gives him an enhanced awareness of danger, allowing him to react swiftly to incoming attacks. Moreover, Miles possesses the Venom Blast, which could potentially be effective against Homelander's vulnerable spots, such as his eyes. On the other hand, Homelander's superhuman strength and invulnerability make him a formidable opponent. He can fly, giving him aerial mobility, and his laser beams are incredibly destructive. Homelander's ruthless and aggressive nature adds another layer to his combat prowess. However, it's important to note that the boys' universe is known for its darker and more realistic portrayal of superheroes. Homelander is not portrayed as an infallible hero, and he has his weaknesses and psychological vulnerabilities that could be exploited in a fight. Ultimately, the outcome of a battle between Miles Morales and Homelander would depend on several factors, including the intentions of the writers, the context of the fight, and the strategies employed by the characters. Given the vast differences in their respective universes and power scales, it's challenging to definitively determine a winner without a specific scenario provided. Could Miles Morales survive a hit from Homelander's heat vision? Surviving a hit from Homelander's heat vision would be an extremely challenging feat for any character, including Miles Morales. Homelander's heat vision is portrayed as an incredibly powerful and destructive ability in the boys' comic book series. Miles Morales, as the Spider-Man of his universe, possesses enhanced durability and a healing factor, but the extent of his resistance to extreme heat and energy-based attacks is not explicitly defined in the comics. While he has shown resilience against various threats, including powerful villains, it's uncertain if he would be able to withstand the full force of Homelander's heat vision. It's worth noting that Miles Morales is known for his agility and his ability to dodge and evade attacks. His spider sense gives him an enhanced awareness of danger, allowing him to react swiftly to incoming threats. In a fight against Homelander, Miles would likely rely on his agility and evasion techniques to avoid being hit by the heat vision altogether. However, if Miles were to be directly hit by Homelander's full-powered heat vision, it would likely pose a significant threat to his well-being. The outcome would ultimately depend on the specific circumstances, the creative choices made by the writers, and the level of durability and resilience attributed to Miles Morales in that particular story. How could Miles Morales win in a fight against Homelander? To have a chance of winning a fight against Homelander, 
Miles Morales would need to utilize his unique set of abilities and approach the battle strategically. Here are a few possible strategies Miles could employ. Exploit vulnerabilities. While Homelander is incredibly powerful, he is not invincible. Miles could attempt to identify and exploit any weaknesses or vulnerabilities that Homelander might have. For example, targeting his eyes with precision strikes or using his venom blast to disrupt Homelander's concentration and temporarily incapacitate him. Agility and speed. Miles' spider-like agility and speed give him a significant advantage. He could use his acrobatic skills and quick reflexes to evade Homelander's attacks, making it difficult for him to land decisive blows. Miles' spider sense would also play a crucial role in avoiding Homelander's attacks and anticipating his movement. Web-based tactics. Miles could make use of his web-shooting abilities to restrain or immobilize Homelander. By effectively web-slinging and creating intricate webs, he could limit Homelander's mobility, disrupt his attacks, and create opportunities for counterattacks. Environmental advantage. Miles could utilize the surrounding environment to his advantage. If the fight occurs in an area with buildings or structures, he could use his agility to maneuver through the terrain, gaining a tactical edge and creating obstacles for Homelander. He could also use any available technology or objects to enhance his attacks or create distraction. Teamwork and strategy. Miles may consider teaming up with other individuals who possess abilities or knowledge that could assist him in defeating Homelander. Combining forces with other superheroes or individuals with insight into Homelander's weaknesses could increase his chances of success. However, it's important to remember that defeating Homelander, a character known for his immense power, would still be an uphill battle for Miles Morales. The outcome would ultimately depend on the specific circumstances, the choices made by the writers, and the creative direction of the story. A fight between Homelander from The Boys and Miguel O'Hara, also known as Spider-Man 2099, from the Marvel Universe, would be an interesting clash of powers and abilities. Let's compare their attributes. Spider-Man 2099. Enhanced Physical Ability. Miguel has the proportionate strength, agility, and reflexes of a spider, similar to traditional Spider-Man. Accelerated healing. He has a regenerative healing factor that allows him to recover from injuries more quickly than a regular human. Talons and Venomous Fangs. Miguel's costume includes talons and venomous fangs, giving him extra tools in combat. Webbing. He can produce organic webbing from his forearms, which can be used for swinging between buildings and creating web-based weapons. In a fight between these two characters, Homelander would likely have the upper hand in terms of raw power and durability. His heat vision alone would be a formidable weapon, and his flight capabilities could make him difficult to catch. Miguel O'Hara would need to rely on his agility, webbing, and intelligence to outmaneuver Homelander and find ways to exploit his weaknesses. His accelerated healing might also help him endure Homelander's attacks to some extent. Ultimately, the outcome of the battle would depend on the specific circumstances, the strategies employed by both characters, and the creative direction of the writers. While Miguel O'Hara is a skilled and resourceful fighter, Homelander's immense power would make him a formidable opponent. Homelander is likely to win most of the time against both Spider-Man. Even if they were to team up against the Homelander, neither has a significant strength that can take down the Homelander. And there you have it, folks. The epic showdown between Homelander and our dynamic duo, Miles Morales and Miguel O'Hara, has been explored from every angle. We've delved deep into their powers, strategies, and the thrilling possibilities of this encounter. In the end, determining the victor in a clash like this can be as subjective as it is speculative. Each character brings their unique strengths to the table, making it a battle for the ages. But what's certain is that the world of comics is a treasure trove of imagination, where battles like these ignite our creativity and inspire endless debates among fans. We want to express our deepest gratitude to you, our amazing viewers, for joining us on this journey into the world of comic book battles. Your passion and engagement mean the world to us. If you enjoyed this epic showdown and want to see more electrifying battles or if you have suggestions for future matchups, please let us know in the comments section below. We love hearing from you. And, of course, don't forget to hit that like button, share this video with your fellow comic book enthusiasts, and subscribe if you haven't already. It's the best way to stay up to date with all our thrilling content. That's a wrap for today's Versus, the ultimate superhero showdown. Until next time, keep the debates friendly. The comics close and your imagination soaring. Signing off. Thanks again for being part of our fantastic comic book community. Stay super. Wah, 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 wah.